My name is Nigel West. I've lost my voice, uh, but I write books on the security and intelligence services, and I've devoted much of my life of tracing wartime double agents. Celery is an unusual character because he's a scoundrel and a rogue, which makes him particularly colourful and interesting. And he was a patriot. What he's accomplished more than anything else is travelling to Germany when he had no need to do so. And during the Second World War, every minute, every second that he was in Nazi-occupied territory, his life was at risk. And that means that he went above and beyond the call of duty, even for a double agent. When I began writing this book, it was, to me, it was all about family. You know, I mean, think in 2008, my grandmother, my mother, died. And of course, for everybody, that's a very upsetting thing. And it was for me, particularly because she had no relatives. There was just my brother and I and my father, and that was it as far as we knew. So I thought, surely this beautiful woman can't leave this world without some of her relatives knowing that she even existed and that she's passed. And it turned out there were six women involved. Four of them were wives, two of them were mistresses. And there were six children, five of them sons, and my mother was the only daughter. And, you know, whilst I was really happy to hear about this, it did take me some time to actually process the reality. But I think the mere fact of seeing a family I think actually he'd be very proud of being part of this family. Um, obviously, what he did was quite unusual in those days. People didn't get married four times. Um, and bearing in mind that the older he got, the younger his wives got. So um, I think he'd love to have been here. Well, we have to admit his spy cover has been blown. <laughs> Completely. Uh, Regarding the book, I have no doubt whatsoever that he would have been both envious and spellbound. As to what she has put together, it's unbelievable. Oh, I love her book. It, she brings him to life. She hasn't just written, you know, dry historical account. Not that there's anything wrong with dry historical accounts, but she's really brought the character of Celery alive, and that's quite difficult if you're actually related to him. He is such a fantastic, colourful character. He is one of the great characters of the Second World War in terms of you know, British intelligence. Uh, for Carolinda to have gathered together so many of Celery's descendants is, I think, not only a very important story, but it's a very human story as well. We can't avoid but being very touched and affected by this. Thank you. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.